Good morning, beautiful people. Latte art courtesy of Eloise. She's the only one awake, everybody else is sleeping. I wanted to go for a walk today, but there are a lot of community cats here. Some of them have their, like the older cats, have their right tip, tip ear clipped. And I looked that up, and that usually means that they are community cats. No, Eloise, because they're scared of us. We're gonna sit here and gain their trust. Um, usually means that they've been captured um, they call it like trapped, uh, spayed, neutered, what? vaccinated release program. Like There's like six cats in general, or in total, I, at least from what I've counted. And they just kind of like chill around here. We just got here probably two days ago. This is our new spot that we're staying at, RV park. Really nice, I'll show you guys around in a little bit. But yeah, there's like six community cats here and I tried feeding them yesterday to gain, gain their trust. Um, they are very, very skittish. And then we came back from a walk one day and someone left like that bag of cat food. It literally just appeared out of nowhere. I don't know who it was. I don't know if it was like one of the campers or where it came from. Maybe somebody already knows the deal and like knows how to feed them. I don't know. I, we just got here. Some people have been staying here for like six years, like living on this um, campground because you can stay here temporarily longer times but we're about a half hour away from Houston I'm really excited because tomorrow's my birthday we're gonna do some exploring but today I wanted to um, kind of do like a pre-birthday vlog I'm gonna grab my coffee and we're gonna go for a walk I'll show you guys a bit around here it's actually very nice very very nice try not to impose on people's privacy privacy this is the main entrance here it has this beautiful pool sitting right on the lake the lake is gorgeous and then the entire campground kind of like loops around i miss the walks on the beach but you know this is nice as well they do have a fitness room they have like a community room laundry i mean look at this pool so nice so this is the other side of the campground like i said it loops around you have the train tracks on the side which is kind of cool because we love all love trains in our family i initially wanted to do like a birthday get ready with me type vlog like do my lashes Mama, and stuff actually i don't want to be a painter you don't want to be a painter anymore or a cooker you only want to be a painter she told me yesterday she wanted to be a cooker and a painter i'm like okay but i would just take you guys along my day today and i have a few errands i want to run i have never driven around this area because we just got here my husband has a little bit I haven't pick up an Amazon package, return an Amazon package, buy some coffee beans because we've been drinking Starbucks coffee beans and the blend that I have it's just Starbucks is like my um, it's like my backup blend if I'm like all out this is the blend that I go for so we need some new coffee beans I want to pick up a cake there's like a local bakery around here that I found that does cakes that are already made in case you need one like last minute. So I want to do that, stuff like that. So if you guys are interested, then tag along. Wow, it's just so peaceful here. One of them looks like a tuxedo. Mm-hmm, he does. I was what wondering. What if it is tuxedo? <laughs> In Texas. <laughs> no. Look at those cute little white mitten paws. I was wondering how they're so well fed for being like community cats. You can see that the black one has like his ear tip clipped. The other two are still small, so I don't know if it has to do with, or maybe they just, just haven't gotten into them, I don't know. But yeah, they're definitely some well-fed cats, I'll give you that. <laughs> Which is kind of cool that people like take care of them here in this community.
set and ready to go. Fun fact, I rarely <laughs> finish my coffees at home. This is the OOTD. I decided to put a cap on because my hair, I'm gonna wash it tomorrow before we go out. I just didn't feel like washing it again because I washed it yesterday. I didn't want to talk while I was getting ready because of the AC, but I have these shorts from Abercrombie. We've had them for a while, love them. Like a sports tank, H&M blouse, and then these kicks right here that I mentioned in my Amazon haul, which I'm actually gonna return this one here, this set here, this set pair. It's a pair, not a set. I'm gonna return this pair here because they were too small. I got them in a size six and a half originally. Yeah, and they were like just right, and I knew they'd be uncomfortable with time. I need a little bit more wiggle room, so I got a seven. So yeah, let's go. Come on, neighbor. Rianca, are you excited to hang out with me today? Yeah. Yeah, mama. And the Viana day. This is gonna be fun. Ma Viana day. Mama Viana day. <laughs> I've, I used to drive the truck back home all the time because it was our only car, but I haven't driven it many times since we've been RVing, since my husband's usually always when traveling, and especially in a new area. So pray for me, guys. You know, I'm getting put on my glasses so I can see I'm nearsighted a bit and then I kind of like planned out our entire day based on I mapped everything out to make sure I'm not like running from one place to the other so we're gonna hit up the UPS store first return the sneakers and then Alta and Target are in that vicinity so I'm gonna hop into both all right let's go what I had was a um Heb, I've never heard of it. Must I be thought local Heb to Texas, a, maybe? I don't know. A, a, a repair store. You thought it was a repair store? Apparently, yeah, it's a grocery store, fresh foods. But just return the UPS package in and out. And now I'm going to go across the street. There's the Target and Ulta. I want to go to Target. I want to buy some candles for the cake. And then just check out what else they have at Target. Because I haven't been to Target in a while. Since we've been traveling, we don't really, you know, other than grocery shopping, we don't really just go to stores, which I guess is a good thing. Um, and then I want to hit up Ulta and see if they have, I want to try the Kopari Sun Shield. I was going to get it on Amazon, but the ship time is like so long. So I'm just going to try to buy it. Store. Pulled in in the parking lot. This is called a Super Target. That's I don't think, target. I have no idea. I've never been to a Target that's called a Super Target, but Where? Can I see it? it has the word super in front of it. I think super just means that it has groceries maybe. Kind of like Walmart back in the day. It used to just be regular Walmart and then it became like super centers. Gotta restock on my favorite cleanser. Although I might buy it on Amazon because Amazon has it as well and I still have a bit. But they have Naturium at Target. I love Naturium. This is what I wanted to see. I wanted to try this out. I keep hearing so many good things about it. I'm gonna grab these and do like, my plan is to do just like one in the middle and then the rest can use for the kids' birthdays. I thought these were kind of cool. They look like pearlescent ones. I'm gonna check the sunscreen section because if they have the Kopari here, which I said it's out of stock, then that means I don't have to go to Alta. Rebond technology, patent pending. Back in the car. I feel like a lot of this vlog is gonna be in the car just cause you know, you don't wanna be walking around the store with your camera being that person. But um, I ended up putting the e.l.f. Halo Glow liquid filter back because I want shade medium for like the summertime. They had light medium, which actually probably would have been fine. But I'm, d I'm going to Ulta anyway to get the Kopari sun shield. So I'll check if they have, they should have the Halo Glow. It says that it's in stock. We're back in the car. <laughs> I feel like this whole vlog is literally gonna be in the car, but stopped in Ulta. Found everything I was looking for. It's always tempting to like, buy all this other stuff of Yann's like testing all the eyeshadows you can't tell by her shirt here um, but they have the Kopari sun shield which you can test both of them they feel super like luxurious like a luxurious body oil I ended up getting the gold one they came out with the new one the rose gold look at how luxurious this oil looks it's like looks like liquid gold in a bottle and it has SPF 50 and you just literally you just apply it like you would a body oil and it just feels so luxurious and hydrating I don't know I saw 
Juge Havens post about it on her Instagram. So I decided to look it up and I think another brand makes something similar. Ugh, oh, it smells so nice. It's a little pricey, but it's very, it has like this luxurious feel to it. There was another one, another brand that makes like a body oil. Shoot, I can't remember. I'll try to insert the name here. So this will be nice to use like around the pool. And then I picked up the Halo Glow Filter. I got the shade Medium, which on a regular day, I feel like it might be too dark. My hands are like so greasy now, I can't even look at it. It's one of those things that like became TikTok viral and then everybody wants to try it. It has like the Dofa applicator. Um, I don't know, it looks like it might be a little too... It has like a bit of pink undertones instead of yellow. So I feel like it might work well with my skin color when I'm like pretty tan. Obviously not when I'm fair. But we'll see. I'm going to test it out and see. But we are actually a bit hungry. I'm going to find a little cafe. See if I can find a cafe for some coffee and like, like a brunch. brunch. Yeah. Girl, you are speaking my language. And then after that, we're going to pick up the cake and then probably go home and hang out. Because it's a beautiful day. It's like 80s. The weekend's going to be 80s. And then next week, it's going to get cold down to like 60s. We decided to go to Dunkin Donuts. You can't see it, I was gonna show you guys in the rear view. Uh, just like a piece of home, Dunkin Donuts was like my go-to back at home. And they have some good croissant breakfast sandwiches. Yeah, Let me tell you that. We got the goods and the little bakery is only four minutes from where the Dunkin Donuts was. Destination okay, is on cute. your right. They don't have any cakes. She said they're so backed up. She said, I'm so sorry, we're so backed up. But that kind of sucks. I'll see, maybe I can get one at like a Kroger no, that really or sucks. some kind of store. I guess it's no big deal, but I am hungry. Let's get a first sip of this. Why didn't you get any of a sandwich? Mm. <sighs> Tastes like home sweet home. Well, not really, but it reminds me so much of home. And then the sandwiches, That's when they're yours. fresh. I got the same exact one as you. you did? Mm -mm -mm. Say no more. I am enjoying some time by the pool. My kids were here, but they left. When the sun is out, it feels really nice. But when the sun goes away and the wind blows, it is a little bit colder. Um, I picked up this Maui, Maui Bay browning lotion as well. A few people I follow talked about it in the past years ago. Um, I just never like bought it. But now that I have a pretty decent tan on, I want to give it a try and we'll see. It doesn't smell that great. I guess you just rub it in. It feels very moisturizing and hydrating. I look like I am a slathered in oil. Um, it smells okay, I guess. I think they have an SPF one. So, I don't know. We'll see. You can apply it on top of your sunscreen as well. The team bought me a birthday balloon! And you got one too? I picked that one! Yay! So cute, thank you, I love it! Vadim ended up going to the store, we needed... He forgot the soy sauce, that's why we sent him. He made that sushi bake, and we're like, oh, we need soy sauce. So he's like, okay, I'll go to the store. Um, he got that and we wanted ice cream, got a bunch of ice cream, and then he got me these beautiful flowers. Love them. So sweet. Uh, we got a cake. He picked up a cake because I wasn't able to find one. I think he went to Kroger, if I'm not mistaken. Um, and I think he forgot the soy sauce. <laughs> it happens. We're just gonna go outside and enjoy some time outdoors. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, Still here working on my, wow, the lighting is just amazing. But still here working on my Dunkin' Donuts. Is that gross? Like, it's not bad, it's not spoiled, but I've been carrying this around with me all day. This is what I mean, like I don't usually finish my coffees. I think I'm gonna finish the vlog here because I feel like it's gonna be really long, although a huge chunk of it was basically hanging out in the car. I was running errands. Um, I didn't get to get the cake, but my husband got the cake. We're gonna try it out. It's called Italian Cream. I wanted like a cream cheese 
frosting type cake because I don't like like the buttercreams. I'll try it tomorrow. I'll try to vlog tomorrow. We were going to go to Houston, but we decided not to, or at least I decided not to because I'm thinking since it's Sunday, it's going to be like a really nice warm day, like high 60s. It's the weekend. Everybody's probably going to be out. I wanted to tr visit a few gardens and parks and cafes and try a sushi restaurant, but I'm thinking there's going to be so much traffic since it's the weekend. So it probably would be better to go during like midweek when people are working and things like that um, so that's just like my thinking behind that but tomorrow we'll probably order some sushi chill by the pool just have a chill day uh, we're all gonna lose an hour of sleep so that's not fun nonetheless I hope you guys enjoyed hanging out this wasn't like the most interesting vlog where I like took my camera everywhere but just wanted you to get bits and pieces of my day today as I kind of did mini birthday prep so I hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with me thank you guys so much for watching and Hopefully I'll see you guys soon.